Canada and like Banu, what they wanted just to stop right to change, should have been a yellow card. And of course, Canada one knows the threat that right to change poses any time. Quite a very strong game in this very, uh, very early exchanges. It feels like we've done 30 minutes already, but it's only 12 or 30 minutes on the clock. Exactly. You love the tempo, you love the energy. Salim Adams did very well to get the ball away. Okay, to Obi Junior, but he was crashed into. will have the advantage. Salim Adams growing stronger and stronger with each and every game. And sportingly, Mawako would give the ball to to Ibiana Stars. It's a throwing advantage. And what is wrong with Ibiana up front is that Brighton J is doing a lot of movement, a lot of hold up on the ball. Trying to be very quick and intelligent, but would not see too much of Budasiri yet. He's supposed to be that man who, you know, connects very well with Brighton J up front. Here's Emmanuel Jenfi. He's got pace, he's got speed as he goes down the left. Decides to get in the cross, blocked by the uh, defense of the Phobians. And they would run into another sprint of an attack. Nerudin's pass, good enough. Benjinia turns nicely, still keeps, his maintain, uh, keep, still keeps his composure as he maintains the run. Cross comes from uh, captain. Series of headers eventually cleared out of the 18 yard box. I don't free pawn now. Any time has a folk get the opportunity to go on the counter, they look really dangerous. Those crosses, it just look like a good job in junior. Very good player. He holds onto the ball very well. Well, he's been making some poor judgment, Mohamed Abbas in defense for Indiana Stars. And it seems he's finding it difficult to hold on to Salim Al who has been pretty brilliant in the game so far. The Phobians will come forward 15 minutes gone. challenged end-to-end -end game we've seen here over the last quarter and from the defense they cross the center line strong running by Hafiz Adams now they come through the middle now a pass will have a go at it strong pass through all right again this time Mohamed Alassane showing his experience clears out nicely Salim Finding it difficult to pick it up. And Abbas once again in the thick of affairs as he goes down. Well, it feels football is a game of contact and a little bit of contact on Salim Adams. It shouldn't be penalized, but you know, from behind, it's always going to be a free kick to Salim Adams. Yeah, it's like a slight push as well. And just look at stores showing all over Salim Adams. That was a good call from the referee. Sell of bless. Yeah, very harsh challenge from Abbas Mohamed. Head coach Samuel Guedu. In a chat before the uh, commencement of the game, believes that many a team are 
chasing the royal diadem, the yeah, current league leaders, Pumase Asante Kotoko, and the eyes are all on them, and so he's taking it one game at a time, and Accra Hearts of Hope will come forward, well taken away from them, kept in play, was it, all went out, it's going to be a throwing advantage, throwing advantage to Accra Hearts of Hope. Abbas Mohamed is not going to continue. He's playing no part in the game. Ball taken away from uh, Robin Jinia. That was a strong challenge there from uh, Caleb. So Idrisu is on for Abbas. It's a very charged atmosphere than the one we witnessed when Kotoko came here atmosphere indeed very charged and you can tell hours before you know the teams even trooped onto the field the fans were all fired up for action they think that this is the time for Adriana Stars to cement some superiority over the Phobians don't forget Adriana came to Accra and only managed to uh, pick up one point and they're singing the war song On he goes. Richmond I takes the place. And is it that time? No the two goalkeepers have something in common. Richmond I is name start with R. And the I also start with A. Richard attack start with R. And of course they attack start with A. Something in common. Virtually around the same height too. <laughs> So sportingly, it goes back to Accra Hearts of Oak and it will be a very first goal kick. There's more last than 40 minutes. Five of the minutes remaining, but we definitely will have time added on. Clash there in the heart of uh, midfield, but it's controlled nicely. Handball, at least as the game should continue, or being brought down. And now Jeffy goes for a ride. Jinfi comes up against Fatao. Tries to set up the, uh, the pass. And the ball rolls over the line. Fatao was trying to prevent the corner kick. Alaji Akambi looks quite worried at the stage. Yeah, from the look on his face. He knows how to focus in the battle. Corner kick to Ebiana Stars and it's Jafi. Turned out by Moa Lansan is returned. And Ayi makes a first save. Max gets out of defense. Caleb goes down from that uh, tackle from uh, Brighter J. Yeah, a little trip from behind. From the pass of Salim Adams, uh, Brighter J. Yeah. I don't think it was intentional though. No, I don't think so. An unfortunate clip. Again, it seems to be in some amount of pain. Fourteen, 14 meetings these two teams have had and the Diana Stars have won three times. Eight of them have been draws. And the rest have been wins for the uh, Phobians. Kaleba Mangwa seems okay. And they're good to go. On the bench for Ibiana Stars, by the way, is Yaya Mohammed. And he may be called into action when the going gets tough. Yeah, we've seen players come on and change games, and Yaya Muhammad starting a game changer. Yes. Good work by Adam Frimpong. Plays out nicely. 
referee noticed that infringement. Selom Yao Bless. I think that was a good call from Yao Bless. I mean, a little attack on the shirt from Awaku on Adolf Frempong. After Adolf Frempong went around and bring at him. Yeah. Long ball headed by Murasiru, but cleared out by Nkuma Kosa. Picked up by Aqua. But Aqua had to full fight to get back the possession through Nuruddin. And uh, Kosa, can he go around his marker? He does so with some amount of difficulty. Lays on the pass. This looks good for Glaxon Awaku as he turns. He needs to open up the game. And they come forward through Kaleb. Kaleb finds Salim. to make uh, some passes through the opening gaps and of course they're uh, opening up the defense in the process if you understand Caleb once again Awaku looking for a shot from a distance Nuruddin changes his mind it's in Kruma Kosa now manages to get across into the 18 yard box and the ball will roll over the line Akra has to book appeal for a corner kick and not forgive it and in the stands here this afternoon, we've seen a few of the Accra Hearts of Folk ladies. And they are here, quite a number of them. They've been on the road for the last... They've been on the road for the last three days, I can tell you that, because uh, they were in uh, Kumasi as part of the delegation to support Accra Hearts of Folk young player, Perfi, who lost his uh, dad. And then uh, they continued to Doma to cheer their team on to victory. So seven minutes of time added on, says our fourth official. Oh! Amazing! Sam Adams has glorified himself with a goal here this afternoon against the defending champion. Indiana Stars 1, Accra Hearts of Oak Nail. And, and the supporter side, Rogers here, and Renatva Badupa. What a pass to look at the run of Sam Adams. Brilliantly done and brilliant, amazing hit from Sam Adams. I mean, he took all the time, picked the spot, and planted that ball right to the corner of Richmond Ayi's post and Ayi scrambles to, to make that save but couldn't get his hand to it and what a goal amazing goal from Sam Adams we'll talk about that pass in a minute but Whoa, the finish and the supporters are singing to his name and we look at the replay here please just when he got the ball, he had already measured the post. He's not looking at the goalkeeper, but just look at where he blasted the ball. Down the corner and Richmond High beat him. He looks surprised, but that was a super hit. Amazing goal. Well, I can tell you for a fact that Sam Adams is one of the darling players of the fans here in Doma. They love him for his hard work. They also love him for his level of respect. And I think he has rewarded them with a goal here this afternoon. Lovely pass from Prince Alpha at that time. Super ball to locate that run. And this time it was better they lay down for some others to finish off. Tall order it will be for a crowd hard to folk to get themselves back into the game. On the threshold of doing that though, yes, Banya. He wins a corner kick for his effort after the ball came off Idrisu Shaibu. Yeah, I'm sure as a folk, they have the quality to come back into the game. You give them spaces and they will punish you with their quality. Inusa organizes his, uh, his defenseman. As we get ready for the corner kick, it will be floated in by Gladson Awako. Misses all the heads. Rahat of would want to put paid to the pressure being put on them by Indiana Stars. How do they do that? Robert Adosoa comes forward. Fatau. 
back to Soa, drives a long lob in. JT picks it up and boots it away nicely. Right at J. That's well to receive that long pass very well. Can he drive from a distance? No, he turns and leaves the ball behind. I think he's picked up injury once again. Yeah, he's still holding on to his groin. But the groin. Yeah, did very well to battle it out there with two hands of four defenders. Got the better of Adosoa, but couldn't go past Dennis Costa, who has really been very solid down the left side. Dennis Nkrumah Costa, very tough player to, to, to beat with, to contend with, especially when he's under pressure. He keeps his nerves, he keeps his cool, and gets himself out of trouble. For Gladstone Awako, well, he still keeps pulling the strings as the game wears on, but it will be so unfortunate if Brighter J does not finish this game. Yeah, just look at Brighter J, brilliant skill to get away from Costa the first time. And the shot blocked there by Costa. Costa really strong, a tough customer to come against. Has really been very impressive in this game. The game continues. Hafiz. And Prince Aqua gets to the ball. No. Corsa gets there first. So I find Corsa once again. Freaky quickly affected by Barnier. Abraha to Popo have to come through the uh, flanks this time around. Guiana Stars seem to have occupied themselves in the heart of defense. Yes, Corsa. Referee Selom, Yao bless. Brings the first half to an end. Here at the Nana Ajiman. The highlights of the very cross came in from Abbas on that occasion, headed out. And the resultant uh, blast again from Abbas. This time, shot wide. Long ball in from the corner kick, and Enusa rises to the occasion. Sam Adams had an opportunity again. Richard Atta ensured that he went over the top. Obinjinia comes forward with Gladson Nawako. He tries a shot from a distance with his unfavorite left foot. He went wide. But kept the pressure as they came forward again. This time from Salim. Obinjinia was a shame late. Emmanuel Jenfi. He has been probing, putting the pressure on the defense of the Phobians. The cross came in, missed everyone, including Sam Adams. Eventually it had to go to her face, and then Mudasiru's connection did not go too far. Then Richard Atta picked up an injury, a very, very worrying injury there, and so came on uh, Richmond. But on this occasion, the drive from Sam Adams had the better of Richmond, i.e., getting the only goal of the first half for Apiana Stars.